I don't know about you guys, but I struggle with doing social media videos more often than not. Creating social social media videos is not one of the easiest things. I understand that for some people, it's it comes naturally. It's like you have in a moment, you just learn something, you just realize something, you grab the phone, you go to Instagram stories, you publish it, and it just feels like a natural flow. For me, not always natural. I have to get into an effort. I have to create a process and have you know people help me and support me and use all the right technology. And even then, I'm not good. So I don't know how you guys are feeling about this. But in today's video, what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to use the Dub mobile app to actually create social media videos that you can publish across all channels. And here's what I mean by that. I mean, use the Dub mobile app to create a single video, download that video, and then upload it to Instagram, to Facebook, to Twitter, to YouTube. The list goes on, right? TikTok, there's a lot of options here. So... Let's get into this right now. Um, Shannon, if you could just start. Um, actually, I think, Darius, I think you're supposed to start, start on I'm, presets and CTAs, right? Right. I'm okay, so, and then we're supposed to do the Brady Bunch thing where we look yeah. at each other or something. So, I don't know if I <laughs> Go ahead, Darius. <laughs> All right. So before we begin, one quick note is when you guys are posting videos to social media, we always want to take advantage of the algorithm. And one of the important parts of that is not taking people outside of the platform. If you do that, the platforms don't like it and they won't show your post to quite as many people. So one of the ways to take advantage of this is to upload your video natively as an MP4, which we're going to cover in the next part of this. The part I'm going to talk about here is how to get additional engagement and tracking and conversions from that social post. As you guys know, Dub enhances every video you create on the platform with your calls to actions, playlists, tracking, and more. And this is all going to take place at one time using your preset. Now, if you don't know what a preset is, attend a live training, search our help articles. You need a preset. I'm going to show you what they are right now. Now, when you create a video on Dub, Dub is going to apply your preset to your videos. Here is an example of my booking page. You can see it has a custom background, some logo, some branding, some colors, but more importantly, it has my call to action buttons and my playlist of additional content. My calendar is directly integrated here so people can book a time from my video page. Now, as I just mentioned, you don't wanna take people outside of the platform you're posting on in the post itself. So as I'm coming into LinkedIn to post this video, which we're gonna create in the next step, as I'm creating this post, in the comments, this is key, in the comments of that post is where I'm going to drop the link to my dub video. And on that dub video is going to have my preset applied where my buttons, my content, my branding, all these things are going to have, all these things are going to exist on this page, including retargeting pixels and, and so many other things for them, the, giving them the ability to chat back and forth with you in a real time conversation, just like they could through the platform itself. Now, this preset is applied all at once. And that's really the magic of it. You don't have to do anything. You can create one video and this preset is going to be applied. And then you would post that in the comments to your social post. You could also recycle that same video where you say something like, hey, thanks so much for engaging with my content. If you'd like to take this conversation online or to the next step or offline or whatever that looks like for you, you have your buttons below where they can call you or text you or email you or book you. And you can recycle that same social content video in the comments, or you can take it a step further and have a custom video for that specific piece of content you just shared. And as I mentioned, having your presets built and applied takes care of this all at once. So every element on that video page, your pixels, your calls to action, your playlists, your branding, subtitles, all of it are part of your template and will be applied to every video you share through your social content. So that is the piece on presets. Actually, one other quick thing, guys. Sorry, let me share my screen again. If you don't already know where presets are, then this is for you. When you go on to Dub, this is the Dub dashboard. And from the dashboard, you have this help section here. 
anything that you're looking for, you can find, just like the word preset, which you will find in the menu. So if you just happen to stumble into it, this is going to show you an article with videos and bullet points and everything you could need to know about how to build presets step by step. So there is your section here. And if you can't find anything that you're looking for, like you can't remember how to spell it or whatever, you can chat with us directly. and We're more than happy to show you everything you need there as well. So preset tutorials are included in the platform and you'll find them in your dashboard. Be sure to build one right away. Nice. Yeah. Assets, um, presets in the left navigation and then go to support.dub.com or click on the little info icon and you can search for the, for the presets article. Really valuable. Encourage everyone to set up their presets and their CTAs as soon as possible because then it's a set it and forget it situation. Once you do your social video, you record it, you set your preset, maybe called social videos, and then everything is ready, including, of course, the download option, which is what Shannon is going to get into in a moment, which is how to use the Dub mobile app to create a, a dynamic multiple clip video with trimming, music, text overlay. Text doesn't work for videos longer than 10 seconds, so just please note that. Um, there's also some other interesting features um, which Shannon will get into. So Shannon, if you could uh, start with that tutorial, get your uh, your phone on the screen here. Yeah, sure. So uh, that sounds like a lot, but really with the Dub app, it's fairly easy to do everything Ruben just described. Um, first of all, just install the mobile app from the iOS App Store or the Google Play Store if you're on an Android device, and you just launch the app. Um, and this is the app dashboard where you get some stats on your videos. But if you want to create a new video, it's as easy as just tapping the blue button at the bottom of the screen. There's actually a lot of functionality that this app has. But I, I want to start by just demoing how to create a video and, and add the different elements that Ruben just described. So I'm tapping on that blue Create a Video button. And this launches the Dub mobile camera. And there we go. You can see <laughs> there it is. And actually, one of the most powerful features of the mobile camera, I just want to say right off the bat, is the teleprompter feature. So with one tap, you have access to the teleprompter, um, which actually is integrated into the camera. And this is a very, you don't see this on many uh, mobile apps. And of course, if you're a business, it's really ha handy just to like pull up a script and have some notes. Um, and you know, it's it, you don't have to necessarily use it as a, as a word for word script, but just having some notes as you're recording a video is really, really handy. So I'm just gonna tap on the red record button uh, to start recording a clip, and that's that's as uh, that's as easy as as it is with the Dub mobile app. Of course, to record another clip, um, first you can tap to stop this clip, and then you can add another clip by just tapping again. Um, now, this this will actually allow us to do something we call real time editing. So with mo like if you just use your native camera app, you'd have to record multiple clips and then stitch those clips later in editing software. But with the Dub mobile app. As you can see now, I've already have two different clips, and those are automatically merged um, when we export and upload the video. And so essentially what you're doing is you're editing your video in real time. It's going to save you a lot of time later on. So I can actually tap and hold on one of these clips to reorganize the clips. Um, and I can do other things to these clips, such as tapping on one of the clips. There's um, editing features. I'm going to tap on Edit. Here we have different uh, features on the right sidebar, such as music. You can add music. Uh, we can have a text overlay. So I can say, hello, Rob. Hello. And hello. So now when I send this video to Rob, um, you know, it's really going to be clear. And as you can see, I can actually use two fingers to uh, drag and tilt. I'm, I'm using two fingers to pinch the text. And then I'm actually rotating the text with my fingers, which is really handy. Um, so I'm going to tap to render that. And now I can send this to, to Rob, and he'll see that in the animated GIF preview that Dub generates. Um, so after that's finished rendering, then we'll have more editing options. Um, you can see that that was applied to that. Uh, if you tap on, a on, you can trim the clip as well. If I went through all of them, you know, I could, I could demo. Uh, there's actually a voiceover clip, uh, or sorry, a voiceover functionality, which is really good for if you're just using the back camera. Um, here you can switch over to the back camera. So clearly, there's there's so much you can do with the with the Dub mobile app, but it's still pretty easy to use. It's a very simple interface, um, and if 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 it looks like you know, we actually have a lot of, of resources for for helping the more detailed tutorials. But um, right now, I'm just gonna tap on this button to go to the next phase. We're gonna merge the clips, 
And I would say too, the more that you use the app, the easier it gets. We really made the interface to be intuitive. So if an icon looks like a scissors, it probably means it's going to be trimming feature. Or you know, if the icon looks like a music icon, that's probably going to be the music icon. Um, uh, this is a one-time thing where you can allow access to uh, your photos, um, and and then the next time it'll it'll save that functionality. But here we have some options. There's actually a speed functionality I didn't even mention. You can speed up the clips. So really, there's a lot a lot of things you can do. Um, and then with one tap, uploading that to the Dub platform, the video is uploading. And what would usually take time, with again editing software to put that text overlay on, merging those multiple clips together. Um, all of that just took me just a few minutes here. Um, and then you can also rate the app five stars, uh, which I recommend you doing in the App Store. Um, and then after that done, it, you can just, yeah, it uploads to your account. So as you can see here in the videos, if I just tap on videos, there's the video that I just created. Um, I can tap on it again to then see a preview of the video. And uh, here we have some sharing options. You can copy a link in an animated GIF to send from your email app, any email app, or you can tap on the sharing option there to send via SMS um, and, and and pretty much anything. You can copy the universal link. Um, so yeah, that, that's a quick demo. There's a lot of other features in the app, such as the tasks. It's fully integrated into Dub CRM features. So tasks and the and of course the activity reporting. So you can get deep analytics on the videos that that you've created. So that's all accessible within the app. And here's what's amazing about that video creation process is that that single video that Shannon just created, uh, Shannon, if you could revisit it and click the three dots, we can show how there's a download link. And what's amazing about this is that if you download this video now, either on desktop or on your mobile device, you can actually upload this video with multiple clips, with music, with text overlay, with voiceover. You can upload it to all those different social channels. Channels like Instagram, Instagram Stories, Instagram Reels, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, YouTube Shorts, um, even even YouTube. You know, you can do a landscape video and upload a video entirely to YouTube. So, one example of how you can use the Dub Mobile app to create a single video that you can then upload to multiple channels. Um, for people that know what that's like, um, it's difficult because normally you have to use the native device, the native channel, and then record a separate video onto every single channel. Yes, you can download a video from TikTok and then re-upload it into Instagram, but it's not it's not optimized for that. In this case, you have a single source file that you can then broadcast to multiple channels. So without further ado, we're actually going to show what it looks like for us to create a social video. Rob, are you ready to rock? Because I know you, uh, you know, you're great at this and you make it look so easy, but obviously you have a lot of practice. So um, take us through it. Yeah, a lot of the times, you know, Ruben and I will do it as a team. We'll get things going. But, you know, just from a carrying it out perspective, you come up with a topic. What's my topic going to be? Well, it's going to be the ABCs of selling. Now, as we know, anyone that's heard ABCs over the years always be closing. But here's an example of that. So I get the mobile app. Let's get in frame here. You know, got my phone. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. So I'm going to hit it and say... Hey, everybody out there. This is Rob from Dub. Hope you're all doing well. Today, I'm going to give you a quick little video about the ABCs of selling. No, nope, not always be closing. It's always be connecting. Always be connecting. Because if you're not connected, you're not going to communicate. You don't communicate. You don't close. And the easiest way to do that, with video. And not just one video, Dub video. Boom. Then you send that out, you go across your social channels, but the whole idea of you know the mobile app being so incredible for social videos in particular is that like Shannon just literally showed, it's so easy to use. The last thing you want to do is be fumbling around with tech as you're trying to get your content out there, your personality, your branding, everything you want to do. You just want that to be on auto as far as understanding it. And Dub makes it so easy to do that, like Shannon just showed. From a content perspective, make it fun, make it quick, make it related to what you're doing, and keep it on brand. So that's something Ruben and I are always big on, and we love doing the videos. So there you go. Nice. Thanks, Rob. Um, there's a couple of features here that are only accessible if you have a paid account. So if you have not upgraded your dev account, please consider doing so. Um, you just click on the little subscribe button at the top or you visit dub.com forward slash subscription. Um, the presets is a paid feature, um, multiple calls to action, um, the ability to high, to record high def videos um, and, and among other videos, among other features as well, I should say. So thank you so much for tuning into this video. Um, we are going to be doing this on a recurring basis just to be educating the community as we always do. So stay tuned. 
please join us live in this video. And uh, the story continues on Dub. Thanks, guys. Bye, guys. Shannon, I think I think this is where you in the video, or is this where I end? How about we do this? I think the usability was good. The price was right. Um, every, everything just seemed to work. It has been fantastic. Dub is one of the top tools for my company and our our business development, prospecting, lead nurturing, deal nurturing. It, it, I do I do Dub videos for almost everything, and mm. people love it. Thanks, guys. Fantastic See podcast. ya. Farewell.